Welcome Sagittarius and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please know, I swear, and this is a tough love, say it out, it is type of channel. So if you're not into those types of readings, well, you know what, you've been warned. So it's on you now. <laughs> um, all right, guys, if you're back, welcome back. Uh, I appreciate the support, guys. Um, we are going to do a no contact reading for this series for all the signs. So if you got ghosted or you ghosted somebody and you want to see what the fuck's popping off with this, that's what we're going to look into. Um, keep in mind, guys, not every single Sag reading is going to resonate with you. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If there's no messages in this reading for you, feel free to check your other placements for messages. So uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or crosswatch on your person and do a little spying. And remember that the energies can be reversed, especially if you are crosswatching. So let's get into it, guys, and we're going to look at your past with this person. Meta coins are really, really fucking slow moving. So slow moving. Like, is this shit going anywhere? Because I can't tell. Are we moving? Hello? Hello? Okay, sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm in a mood. Um, Nine of wands in reverse. There you are, Sag. That's you. Um, <laughs> Being so extra today. Um, nine of wands in reverse. Yeah, this person was in and out of your life. Um, they had like trust issues, probably why they were moving so slow. Um, I don't know if shit ever got anywhere. Let's see. Um, a six of wands. Your person could have been really, really needy and need a lot of attention and a lot of ego stroking is what I heard. Okay. Knight of coins is... Virgo Leo, but I'm feeling Taurus energy. Sorry. But you could have been dealing with a Taurus here. It doesn't have to be. Um, slow. So goddamn slow. So goddamn slow. I feel like it went nowhere. Because I don't think this person was into it for the right reasons. I feel like they just wanted the attention. The ego stroking. That, you know, I'll come get my fix and I'm out till I need another fix. So let's see the current energy. Ace of Wands in reverse of the world. I feel like this shit is over. It's over, Sag. You're manifesting the shit you want. Um, I do feel like you have a little bit of a lack of direction. You may be feeling really restless. Um, cause I feel like, you know, this is closing out and now it's your job to manifest whatever the fuck you want. And I feel like maybe you don't know what you want. Ten of swords at the bottom. So you're still carrying that energy that, you know, feeling betrayed type of energy. So like, yeah, you know, it's over, but you are still carrying some shit around and you don't know where to go from now because you're still, is that the five of pentacles? Wow. Okay. Look at this shit, guys. You need to get out of that energy, of that boohoo, left in the cold, backstab, betrayed type of energy. Okay, because we all get betrayed, we all get left in the cold, this person's a dumb dumb, so, um, you know, whatever. I can't stand people and their stupid ego stroking shit, okay? I've dealt with people like that. I can't deal with a lot of shit, sorry, I'm a Leo. I'm opinionated. <laughs> I feel how I feel and I'm feeling some type of way um, this person was a waste of your time um, I feel like you need to accept that so you can move on you can accept you need to accept like you know what I ignored the red flags this person was a waste of time I don't know why I kept entertaining them but you know I am not going to do that in the future and move on um, let's see their feelings back then for you towards their feeling now. So four coins, they were holding back a lot in the past. Knight of Swords. Um, this person, no, they felt you were holding back. Sorry. They felt like you were holding back and you were hiding something. Or you weren't like giving it a hundred percent. Um, they felt like you were too focused on money and work and status, um, that you were set in your ways and that you could be a little too, um, 
quick sometimes. Like this person is so slow. Whereas you know that Knight of Swords energy is the opposite of Knight of Coins. I feel like that person was a Knight of Pentacles. You were a Knight of Swords. You're like, let's do this. I want to make this sweat. I want to be with you, blah, blah. Meanwhile, this person's like, eh, I don't know. Um, so they felt like you were too decisive, too quick moving. You're the type that acts and that makes shit happen. Well, they're the type to just, you know, wait 17 years. Um, let's see how they feel towards you now. To a sword. They feel like you're real guarded and that you're not going to budge. That you're putting the time and effort into the things that you fucking want, Sagittarius, which it ain't them. Um, that you're investing in your fucking future. That you're considering your options and what's right for you. Okay, Eight of Cups. Um, they do feel like you're still stuck on them and not moving on. So this person thinks that they still got a shot with you, Sag. It's like... They feel like you're not going to budge, but they also feel like you still care. Like, yeah, you're not going to budge. Yeah, you're like showing me that you're all about that life. But really deep down, Sag, I know you still got the feels. Okay, that's what they feel right now. Um, let's see their intentions towards you moving forward. Five of Pentacles. So they just want to leave you out in the cold. If you left them in the cold, they want the lead. They want the control. They want to be dominant. They want to be like, hey, what's up? So you guys reconnect. And then so they leave you. So they're like, ha, ha, ha. I got the last word. Okay, is this person 12? Like, what is happening here? Um, nine of Coins. Yeah, see? They want to be single. But they want to be single and alone on their own, own terms. How dare you leave them? Sag. This is ridiculous. Sorry. Um, I feel like this is the third reading in a row. There's like ridiculous people. The series started very positive. I was surprised, you know. I'm not the deliverer of good news usually. I have to deliver the hard truth news. <laughs> but yeah. It's back to normal. So this person's just like ridiculous. Like, don't even entertain that nonsense. What are they actually going to do, though? Okay, great, good. Just fuck off already and move on. Okay, so they might actually move on. Move on because they're not going to be taken seriously. You're not going to take their shit seriously. They're going to end up blocked with some self-imposed motherfucking restriction in a prison of their own making. Okay, yeah, sit there in your donkey skin, you donkey. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Sag. Um, if you're pissed at someone and they show up in your reading, you'll have a good time on my channel because I won't like them either. I'll tell you how I feel. But yeah, this person's a donkey. That's how I feel. Based on the reading. So let's see some advice for you moving forward, Sag. What should you do? The sun. You should be happy. You should live your motherfucking life. Okay? Uh, be happy. Have fun. Um, focus on your pleasure, your success. Um, feed your inner child. Do things that make you happy. Page of Wands. No contact. Page of Wands in reverse. Don't talk to this person. Do not hit them up. Enjoy your life without them. Because they bring the darkness. Wheel of Fortune. Okay? It's time for a new beginning, my friends. It's time to um, hit that turning point in your life. So, yeah, Queen of Swords at the bottom. Yeah, cut them off, cut them off. You grab that sword, look how pissed she looks. You cut their head off. Off with the heads. I can't sing. I'm really not going to try, but definitely. You focus on you. You do you. Turning point in your life. Um, no contact. Ignore them. Cut them off. Uh, head over hard. Be logical with this situation. Sagittarius. Okay. Let's see what your person would tell you if they were on truth serum and they could not lie. What is the truth? The whole truth. Nothing but the truth. They all pink. Okay, I thought you were just going to get pink ones. They want to know, do you still care, Saj? 
do you still care? Because I need you to care so I can come in and get the last word. Be single on my terms. This person's ridiculous. I'm sorry. I'm going to try and stop being sarcastic. I should have told you how I felt. I just want to hold you. I don't feel I'm good enough. So this person has some insecurities issue. They never really spoke up. They don't say how they feel. Um, they need time because they're not ready. But they want to see you, but not yet. Okay, because they have to prepare their plan. Um, see, there's no feelings in here. There's no, like, big feelings. Like, there's some very uh, romantical cards in here as well. So, I don't feel like there's any strong feelings. It's a lot of ego. Do you still care? Because I don't feel good enough. I need some validation. I should have told you how I felt. I want to see you. I want to hold you. But I'm not ready. I need time. So, like, whatever. Basically, um... Whatever they'd say on Truth Serum is about as relevant as their actions. <laughs> uh, sorry, you had to deal with that nonsense. Sagittarius, let's see what the oracles have to say. We're going to get a song and then we're going to get a guidance oracle. Deception, deception. This person is just a fucking um, whirlwind of deception. Like Reconciliation, okay, they are going to try to get back with you. Let go of control issues and try to control the situation. Um, I do feel like that comes from pride when you try to control the situation, like just like how they're doing it. They don't want it to end on their terms. They want to control how it ends. You just need to like not give a fuck about the whole control situation and just walk away and do what's right for you. And focus on yourself and keep it no contact unless contact's necessary, right? But addiction, codependent, obsession, possession, controlling has a block, restrained. Um, yeah, this person could have an addiction problem or you could have an addiction problem or you could have been codependent towards this person or vice versa. I feel like there's a few stories here. Looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, making you memories. So this person is missing you. I feel like they are going to hit you up. I don't know that it's anytime soon. I feel like it depends on the Sag. Sabotage, rebuilding, interrogation, repetitive, persistent, working on it. So I feel like you're rebuilding your life. You're working on it. You may have a tendency to sabotage Sagittarius. Um, and this person, I feel like, does want to come in and sabotage But just, you know, ignore it. Ignore the bullshit. And go on with your bad self. Let's get you a song. And like the reading, it is a general song. So it may or may not resonate. Um, Take it as it may. Ego stroke much. This person, ego stroke, ego stroke. Okay, Tove Sturk, say my name. It's like, say my name, wear it out like a sweater that you love, like you can't get enough, or whatever. So it's like, this person likes to hear the sound of their own name. They like, they like ego stroking. This person needs the attention, they need the ego stroking. If it's not you, it's going to be someone else, Sag, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Mm -mm. Telling you. I can't find the middle card. I forgot what it was. But um, the link for that song will be in the description box below. Check it out. It could be like just a title. It could be a message for you, a lyric. Um, whatever it is. Uh, we are going to pull an oracle card from here. For a little guidance message for you. And also, guys, I started my Patreon this month. So if you're interested in that, check that out. There's going to be extended readings on there. Um, a tier with private readings from me, um, exclusive readings, giveaways, all types of stuff. So check that out if you're interested. The link will be down in the description box along with the song. And let's get, just didn't want to go back on it. 
So that's your card, Sagittarius, the distraction of shiny things, okay? So you may be getting distracted lately, um, instant gratification, like, ooh, that's shiny over there, let me go play with it. Um, let's see what the little book has to say. So you might want to focus a little bit more and rein it in a bit, Sag. Essential meanings. Um, a sacred partnership, lovers, a collaboration of like-minded and like-hearted people, support networks, finding your people, mutual, <coughs> Ooh. mutual benefits, um, love and connection, a self-care message. So if you can relate to any of the self-care message and you feel like that's what you're going through in your life, then, you know, that's. The universe telling you that you need to address that, okay? So the self-care messages are doing too much on your own. So if you feel like you're not asking for help um, and you feel like you could use a little help, don't be shy and ask for some help, Sagittarius. Being overly independent, difficulty trusting others and taking them at face value, and problems with partners. So you might want to work on your trust issues and, you know, not trusting people to help you, not being able to ask for help out of pride. So if you feel like you're struggling with that right now, definitely look into that and um, do some meditations for that. But I also feel like, you know, that's not in the book, but I don't care. That's how I feel about the card. Make sure you don't get distracted by stupid little shiny things that are irrelevant and not conductive to where you're trying to go in life, okay? And one of that shiny things could be that fucking ego stroker, looker, seeker you were dealing with. <laughs> You know what I'm trying to say. Um, all right. If you like the videos, make sure the video, make sure you hit the like button. If you're new here and you like it here, make sure you hit the bell and the subscribe button so you can see more videos from me in the future. Um, either way, thank you so much for watching, guys. And hopefully I see you guys in the next one. All righty. Bye.